everybody excuse me if I look scary I've just put powder under my eyes so that um, it catches any fallout for the look I'm about to do this one is going to be a sort of a golden hopefully Egyptian looking look um, I'm going to be predominantly using my Bellatera um, stack and some Giordana liners that's Jordana there. And my um, NYX Jumbo Pencil in Dark Brown. And I think that's it in the sense of eye products. So I'm going to get started. Um, I'm not going to put my foundation on because there's going to be so much fallout because it's loose powder that um, I'm going to. Um, do the foundation afterwards. I may break this down into two videos as well because I do feel I'm rushing a lot to try and get it done in the under the 10 minutes they give me because for some reason I can't upload longer than 10 minutes. So um, I may break this one down, do the eyes first and then the rest of the face. So I've just put my um, Urban Decay Primer Potion on and like I said I've just put some loose powder underneath just here and that will catch any fallout. Right, and then firstly I'm going to use my NYX pencil. I'm not going to put it directly on, but I'm going to apply it with the brush. And then we're going to go over the entire lid. But not any further up than where you hit your brow bone. I wanted to thank everybody so far who's also entered my contest. I may add to the prizes. I was thinking of putting some samples of some MAC pigment in there as well as a thank you. I was thinking of more and more things I could put in the prize. I may do a prize every couple of months actually. It's quite fun and exciting to see everybody as well. Everybody's looks. It doesn't matter if it's messy because we're going to tidy that up. We're only using this dark colour as a base. You could use black bean as well, but um, I wanted to use dark brown. Right. Okay, and then we're going to get a very goldy colour. I think I'm going to go for that one. I don't know if you can see that, that one there. Or should I go for that one there? Let me think. Give me two seconds to do something. <laughs> right, okay, and then what I do with this is I turn it upside down and shake it so that the colour's in the lid. So I think I'm going to go for that top yellowy one. Let me just give it another good shake so that I don't have to um, scoop out of... Actually, I might tip a bit instead, actually. That was a bit much, look. This is the danger. Well, anyway, and now I'm going to get my... This is a brush. I can't remember where it's from. I think it's from Coastal Scents. And I'm going to pack on colour. On top of that. Just sweep that over the lid. Again, don't worry if you get some fallout. You can always amend that later, and that's why we're doing um, foundation afterwards. brush isn't working so well for me so I will use this one. This is just a Helen E brush. I got it free. Right so first 
application I just swept over the lid. Now we're going to pat onto the lid so the colour stays. And I know I look very scary at the moment, but honestly, it'll all work out well in the end. Told you, fall out. Stupid idea. Don't tap it into the lid, it just goes everywhere. Right, and then I'm going to use Jordana eyeshadow in Sizzling Summer. And where that gap there, you can see the brown where it's worked in for the socket. You just want to accentuate that. Just lightly put a pencil, a light kind of goldy, bronzy pencil. Blend with your fingers. I look so scary, it's unbelievable. And go underneath here. So this is kind of like a bronzy colour, I'm going to get my 224. And just above there, I'm going to sweep, it's just a touch of colour. It's more glittery, shimmery than anything. Okay. It looks bad now but I promise, honestly, it will be fine. And then we brush away all the fallout that made me look all scary. Oh, my clip's falling out. And then I'm going to get this. It's the Bourgeois Liner Club in Ultra Black. And we're going to go up, line our eyes ever so slightly. We're going to go up. I always line eye underneath of my eyes, but it's optional. It's like a comf comfort blanket for me. Mm, not quite did. Because I've got beady eyes. So um, I like to line underneath them as well. made a little mistake there so I'm going to use my Max Factor eraser pen. Was it Max Factor or was it Colourstay? I can't remember. Revlon. Can you see? Right and I'm going to stop the video there. I know it still looks pretty scary but um, I'll show you now how to um, put your foundation on and make that a final look. But um, you can see there it's kind of like a yellowy black look, but I promise you it will look better. <laughs>